Hey, what's going on people, Bearfox here and welcome back to another brand new video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys where are the best settings to get more FPS and performance in Fall Guys. Now, I'm COVID positive since the last few days, so all my videos are delayed and if you feel my voice is cracking or being squeaky, then I'm really sorry since the start. But once again guys, I want to let you know that if you have any queries regards to this video, you can leave your specs in the comments below and I'm going to be personally replying to all of you also we are really close to 50k subscribers and we just need 470 more subscribers so once again guys consider hitting that red subscribe button down below it really helps me out a lot let's roll the intro all right so i'm gonna make this video really quick and simple first step first create a restore point just look up for system properties and then go to system protection. In here, look up for any drive it says system with it. Then click on configure and make sure the turn on system protection is enabled. Click on OK, click on Yes, and then click on Create. Name it Fall Guys. And then click on Create and let this thing happen. We do this to ensure the protection of our system. If anything goes wrong, you can always restore it to the point where nothing has happened. So this is a really important step. Once it's done, simply close it and close the system properties as well. Now, most probably you will own Fall Guys on either Steam or Epic Games. But wherever you own it, the thing will be same. I own Fall Guys on Steam, so I'll open up Steam. Now what you have to do is go and search for Fall Guys. For me, it's right here. I'm simply gonna right click it and then go to manage and then go to browse local files. Okay, once you are in the local folder of Fall Guys, what you have to do is simply look up for Fall Guys client.exe and Fall Guys client game.exe. Simply right click on both of them, go to properties, go to compatibility, and then click on high DPI settings, and then click on override high DPI scaling behavior, and then click on OK, apply, and then OK. Simply do the same for Fall Guys client game. Once you're done with that, simply copy this location of the directory and then search for graphic settings. Now once you are in here, simply click on browse and then paste the location on top. Then add fallguysclient.exe and go to options and then select high performance. Simply do the same with fallguysclientgame.exe, add it and then click on high performance. Once you're done with that, simply minimize your graphic settings. Next most important step is your power options. To change your power plan, simply search for power options and then go to additional power settings. Once you're in here, simply click on high performance or ultimate performance if you have in preferred or high additional plans. If you have high performance, you can save it. If you have ultimate performance, you can save that as well. Now, once again, guys, let me say you, if you set on high performance, your device will heat. So make sure to maintain proper cooling environment for your device. Once you're done with all of those steps, simply download Fall Guys FPS Pack. Simply go to the link in the description below and download this FPS Pack. And in here, you'll find in five folders. First one is for Fall Guys Priority, then CPU Tweaks, Windows Tweaks, MSI Utility and Memory Duct. Simply open up Fall Guys Priority and then click on High Priority Registry and then simply merge it. If the merge option is not showing, simply double click and run it. Then go to CPU tweaks and then run all of these three registries. Then go to Windows tweaks and then run all of these three registries. Then go to MSI Utility V3, right click, run it as administrator and in here look up for your graphics card. Then simply from undefined go to normal or high and then click on apply. Now go back, open up the next program which is Memreduct and simply run the setup. Now simply click on next, I agree and then click on next and install Memreduct on your device. Then Memreduct will open. Now in here simply click on clean memory and click on yes. As you can see your memory usage will fall down. I highly recommend you guys to use memory deck each time you play this game. This will allow your RAM to clean up the cache memory in order to save your memory and perform well while gaming. Just by doing this, you're done with the FPS pack. 
And don't worry guys, it's all safe. Okay, last but not the least is the in-game settings. Open up Fall Guys and follow the in-game settings. All right, so once you are in game, simply go to your settings and then go to options. In here, for server region, keep it automatic. For language, keep it to your native language. For resolution, you can go down to your native resolution. That is 1920 by 1080. Maximum Hertz for your monitor. Windowed, keep it off. Vsync, keep it off. FPS rate, you can go to the highest FPS possible by your monitor. For me, it's 240. For texture detail, you can go down with half res. For shadow detail, you can go to low. For motion blur, keep it off. Bloom, keep it off. Depth of field, keep it off. Ambient occlusion. Now this will affect your FPS highly. So you can go with SAO or none, whichever gives you the best FPS. For anisotropic filtering, keep it off. Anti-aliasing. Now if you can keep it to low SMAA or medium SMAA, you can get better FPS. But on FXAA or none, you'll get least fps but once again you can do trial and testing for yourself and then get the best settings for you guys for screen space reflection you can go with none and for static lobby background you can keep it off so that was it for this video guys i hope i could have helped you out if i could make sure to do leave a like and smash that subscribe button it really helps me out growing my channel once again we are really close to 50k subscribers and i believe in you guys we'll see you in the next video until then stay tuned keep watching bear fox and peace out